Well, I think I found one. Now, it's not a waterproof. It hasn't got the sleeve to go over it, but if it, it fits, now, um, if it fits, if you know what I mean. For those of you who've worked with these plugs before, you know what I mean. There's the outer and the inner. So you have to determine if, you know, the outer can fit, so it can fit into the, into the jack, but if the center is too big or too small, uh, it's not going to work. So we have to make sure at that point. And I don't know which one of these is actually center, so i got to take this off here for a minute. got to find my meter, wherever the hell I put that. Okay. I know i got a meter around here someplace. I sure do. If I can remember where I put it. Anybody see it? Anybody see a meter? It's a yellow meter. And uh, it's not that little. So where the hell did I put it? I don't remember using it anywhere. See, this is what I mean. Now, <coughs> ah, it was under my hat. Okay. So now that I found the meter, let's put it on noisy ohms so I can get a beep so I don't have to bother looking at the meter. And uh, let's see what we come up with here. So I am on one wire, and that's going to give me center. So, this one is center, and that's the one that's got the grooves in it. All right, so that took care of that. That was easy enough. These are good meters, aren't they, Matt? You got one of these, I believe, don't you? Okay, so let's put this back. First of all, let me, uh, wait a minute here. Let me, uh, <clears throat> oh yeah, here we go again. Oh, here it is. <clears throat> Let me take a little dab of uh, my magic formula here. Did I use that on everything? Then I kind of wipe it down just a little bit, just to get the surface crap off. And then I'll put it in there. And now I'm going to uh, take a couple of jumpers that I have over here. And uh, find the ground. Uh, wrap that on here real quick. Seems like I can't find the jumper jumpers. I'll just do it this way for now, which will work. It'll do the same thing. Then I'll hook it up to the battery real quick. And uh, we will try it. Um, be right back. All right. On, off. On, turn, turn, down, up. Good. So, it works. So I gotta get that and put it outside. It's getting late, it's starting to get dark, but I think I have time to get that wire run. Uh, Cause I'm not really, I'm gonna run it, I'll bring it in, I'll drop it down over here to the battery just so that it's here for now. Um, but it's not gonna be uh, permanent, uh, the wiring that is, until I actually get everything hooked up and I have my batteries and solar and wind turbine and everything into its little power shed so or power area so anyway let me get this done all right so I butt connected it with heat shrink type with the epoxy butt connectors I put in a strain relief tie so I tied it on both sides so it's got a strain relief on it so it's not going to pull on the plug the plug has got a little sealant spray oil and some sealant in there so I don't have to worry about that but yet I can still get it apart if I have to so now I'm just going to get this hooked up outside all I got to do is drill a hole I got to take out a piece of that insulation which is right there drill a hole which is right there feed the wire through it boom boom bada bing bada bang and I'm done